Hello, today I'm going to introduce you to Wi-Fi file sharing. This program allows you to share your files and folders with anybody you want using different permissions. So let me show you how it works. First of all, you should go to Preferences tab. Here you can choose your preferences. For example, you can set default permissions. That means that if you share your file or folder, these permissions will be assigned to this folder or file as a default. If you need more information about this, you can find it in the Help tab. And if you are still unsure, you can contact me via email. To share your files, you will use the server tab. You can do it even if the server is static. To share files or folders with your own permissions, you have to long tap on the folder or file and choose permissions. For example, I am going to share music and provide full access to this file. The different meanings of the raw color changes you can read about in the help tab. For sharing files or folders with default permission, just tap on the checkbox here, at the right corner. File browser allows you to listen to music, watch videos, edit files, etc. For example, I am going to view picture. Now I'm deleting these files. Let's move on. Now I'm going to show you how another device works with your device. Go to the client tab. We can see our device in the list of devices. In the right hand corner you can see a signal for connection. If it stays red for a long time it means connection is lost. Ok, as you can see we can enjoy music. This music we have is already shared. Now, I want to upload some files to a demo folder. It's really easy. choosing two pictures and just pressing the select button. These files are now uploaded. Keep in mind that you can download and upload multiple files and folders at any time. Now let's delete these files from a remote device. Our permissions allows us to do it. If you look at the background, you will see that the server is refreshed and shows us what's going on. Now, I'm going to show you how browsers work with this application. On the server tab under the stop button, you will see the IP address for the devices and for browsers. Just enter this IP address in your browser. As you can see, the chosen folders are shared. Let's go to demo folder and view some pictures. Oh, 
It's too big. Also, you can preview pictures. Just cover the mouse over the thumbnail picture like this. Ok, now I'm going to test the delete function. To delete something you need permission to edit. In this case we don't have it and that's why we can't delete this file. Remember, each folder and file has permissions. If you want to know the permissions of the current directory, you can check it under the logo right here. Ok, let's download something. I'm ticking the checkbox on the left side of the current files and pressing download. Unfortunately, we can't see our downloaded files because of the tablet. Now I'm going to demonstrate to you how to upload files. By pressing the upload button, I'm adding some files. So, we can now see our uploaded files. Now, let's try to delete them. The permission of these files now allows us to do this because we have uploaded them and have full access to them. As you can see, we have deleted the files without any problem. Now, let's listen to music again. As you can see, we can do it remotely without a problem. Well, share your experience with your friends and remember to use the help tab if you need more information. Thank you for your attention and goodbye.